What's up, everybody? Back at it again with another video. Um, so, update on everything. I've been home for about two weeks, just settling in, settling into the new routine that, you know, I have to go through taking pills and all that stuff. But before we get started, my name is Andrew Opadaka. Um, my dad owns a roofing company called A1 Budget Roofing. Um, this channel is called Drew the Roofer. So for those that are new, all that we, all that I did post was roofing stuff, as you can see on my last videos. Um, anything to do with roofing, tearing off, installing, just kind of why I chose roofing and all that. Um, my content was good. I had a lot of supporters, and I got plenty more supporters during the situation. So uh, about a month ago, a little over a month ago, I got diagnosed with. AML, acute myeloid leukemia. Um, it really changed my life. Um, went from three months of just declining in my health drastically, uh, tired, fatigued, uh, getting sore, getting irritated, nothing to indicate, you know, I had what I had. Um, but yeah, it, it certainly changed my life. Um, changed my life in many ways mentally physically perspective emotionally everything so yeah so now here i kind of just post updates on my life um, there's not really much roofing stuff going on since i can't do that type of work anymore but the good news is next week you know i'm starting to do those youtube videos again i'm gonna go back to selling um so it's gonna be good so you know what i mean just gonna keep it going and just stay positive about life and you know just keep the wheels turning because you know you can't stop but yeah hopefully everybody's having a good time everybody's doing their own thing you know stay active stay fit stay healthy mentally and physically and you know just keep doing the thing but today to kind of backtrack and where i'm at today i've been at home for about two weeks um kind of just falling in, in the groove of things with taking my pills, keeping healthy, staying clean, wearing my mask, and kind of just being healthy in that sort of way so I don't get sick. I mean, God forbid, you can still get sick even when you wear a mask, but you know, taking all the precautions that I can, um, getting out the house, driving my truck. So the videos now are gonna kind of be sporadic. There's not really gonna be a schedule for them, but you know, I'll post when I can post. Like right now, I got my truck and my brother took it off road and stuff like that which you know it's what the truck's supposed to be used for so it's a little muddy so i'm gonna go take it to the self car washing and just do as best as i can to get all the mud off and then have our guy cruise over um armando to come you know give it a good detail and then head out this weekend to go to the desert with my with my cousins and family friends and stuff like that it's gonna be a good time i'll try to get some footage of it um got an extra gopro my mom bought an extra gopro for me so you know it gives me stuff to do so i still got one i could kind of get multiple angles for you guys i'm out in the desert because i can't ride a dirt bike no more i can't really ride a quad so you know my truck is gonna be it's a baja truck anyway so my truck's gonna be what i mainly use to you know go out there and have some fun but yeah hope you guys enjoy these videos i'm gonna go ahead and pull up to this self wash thing and get active all right guys i'll get some footage for you Let's get it. So it's, it's kind of dirty. I kind of washed it off yesterday. Let's check it out. You see, got like the mud over here and stuff like that. And all the shit under there and kind of in the back. And you know, got the little clumps and everything. She's a little, she's a little dirty. Get a cool little front view over. But yeah, we'll do a quick little wash when he comes. Not as much work for him. We fucked it up. And we got it dirty, so let's go ahead and put this in. Five bucks. Let's see. Foam brush. There's a goddamn rings.
that's pretty much about it. Camera got a little dirty. But hey, fuck it. Let's see if we miss the spot. Should be chump. This thing keeps this thing just pops off. It doesn't even spring back no more. So it is what it is. I got a minute left. A minute, might as well use it. Every time I go do something now, it doesn't matter what it is. Every time I expenditure my energy, since I'm so weak from not doing anything for about two months, your whole body just doesn't know how to like handle it. It does, but mentally you feel like you can do a lot of stuff you feel like you could take on the world again but physically highly impossible and i gotta clean my hands with wipes everywhere i go so i just touch that stuff so i gotta clean you know what i mean so it's kind of like it don't matter which cool i got this little clip before i found out what I had because I wanted to make cool videos for every, for all you guys and and then this happened but you know it's all good the other oh shit there's a guy right next to me with another raptor that's dope I fucks with it that's that's sick bro hell yeah it's kind of dope seeing people with the same truck because you know, all of us have the same commonality. But yeah. So, oh, shit. Ugh. So, for all the videos that I have on my channel already, I'll give you guys a little backstory. I started roofing when I was 17, 18. Um, couldn't find a job, applied at a bunch of different places. Couldn't get a job, background checks went through. I'm not a, I don't do nothing. But somehow they always say, oh, it didn't go through or whatever. So my dad asked me to go work for him for a day. And back then, sorry, I got to go on the So back then, I worked for a day for 80 bucks, but it was only like five hours worth of work. But when you're not making money at minimum wage, when I first started working was $9 an hour or $8 an hour. So making 80 bucks working five hours, you're like, gosh, dang, that's a lot of money. You know what I mean? But... So I started working for my dad, the foreman liked me, which at the time was Hector. And uh, we kind of just, you know, clicked. And ever since then, I was my dad said, hey, you want to work next week? And I'm like, sure. After that day, after seeing that money come in, after seeing those paychecks and the cash, I haven't stopped since. And yeah, my dad's the owner, but I didn't get treated differently. I still started from the bottom picking up trash. I was the chalan, as they said back in those days. Uh, when I first started working and ever since then, you know, I worked my way up and that's just the way it's been for the eight years I have been roofing. Um, when I stopped roofing, I was the foreman and the guy in charge. Um, I did a lot more. Um, granted, I am his son, so I was selling. Um, I was talking to the customers, you know, during service calls, repairs, any special custom homes we did, I was there, which was, which was dope. So, you know, I, I put the work in for sure. All the guys respected me for what it was. Um, but yeah, you know, they understand that just because, I'll let this guy go. Just because I'm the owner's son doesn't mean I get treated differently. Uh, I still had to do what they had to do, start from the bottom. I didn't get no, ah, oh, motherfucker. I didn't get no uh, easy way out of it. But, you know, it is what it is. You kind of learn lessons in life going along that way. But, you know, who cares? Uh, you got to live and learn one day or another. But, definitely now, everything's kind of took a turn. Uh, you no longer think of... My, God dang, everybody's honking the damn horns at everybody around here these days. Son of a gun. 
Everybody's in a rush to go nowhere, to go to work, to go do something. Like, just chill. You'll get there when you get there. Frick. Anyways. But, yeah. So, you know, I'm, I'm kind of just chugging along, doing my thing, making these YouTube videos. Uh, there ain't going to be much context in these videos anymore. It's kind of just going to be sporadic. So, whatever I feel like filming is what I'm going to film, to be quite honest with you. Like right now, I just decided to get up, go wash the car, or wash the truck with the mud, and just go drive it. Ooh, and there's another raptor behind me. Hell yeah. I think, I don't know if it's me, but I need to join like a raptor group or something, because I haven't seen a lot. Of, I held, I was joined a group before I went in, and they had these raptor runs and stuff like that, and I wanted to go, and I had it all planned out. I was going to go and everything, and then, yeah, this happened, but you know, there's still more opportunity. And this guy has his favorite color. I like white. The white raptor with the black. Yeah, but I got lead foot gray. Which is still dope. But anyways. Yeah, so today is just kind of like a sporadic video. I just decided to record a video. I'm going to go wash my truck. And then I'm going to go cruise the beach. So I might stick the GoPro on my handle of my truck. So you can guys kind of see the beach. If it works, or I just might flip the camera. But yeah. So yeah, let's hit the road and... video hope you guys enjoyed that little talk in the beginning in the beginning um hope you enjoyed a little bit of cruising on the beach here in cali where i live um but yeah this is gonna kind of be just a little video of what it's kind of gonna look like from now on and stuff like that there ain't gonna be too much too much crazy right now but hopefully next week i am planning on selling with my pops so you know, I'll get some cool footage of that and uh, kind of the process of what my dad and I go through when we're selling. Um, normally I'd probably sell solo, but I can't really go that long driving by myself and working because it's not safe. So yeah, damn, they people just dump their shit on the side of the damn road. Fucks up for everybody. But um, yeah, hope you guys enjoyed. Just kind of enjoying the cruise home, enjoying some alone time, listening to music, and just cruising, you know. But yeah, you guys want to drop some comments, if you guys have any questions, anything like that. Um, I am going to start possibly a new channel called Driving with Drew, um, which is kind of just go along the coast, kind of just take the back roads, uh, play some music, answer questions if you guys need advice or whatever. You know, just kind of just random stuff. But yeah. Alright guys. Peace.